student of this department. And I am now as well, I am a fourth year student in this department. So today we're going to talk about it's time to move on. So we are here to help you and give some advice to move you on. Hi. Yes, I know. ニコメのプレゼンテーションを始まりましたけど、1回目のプレゼンテーションどうでした？生徒さんもさっきのプレゼンテーションが。取り上げてましたよね。すごいですね。もう彼は2年生でもあんだけ英語を伸ばしてや
そのこの1年間でも本当にたくさんの人と出会って大学日本で普通に大学生活を送っているだけじゃなかなか味わえない体験とかもすごいたくさんできたんですよだからもう思い切って自分のやりたいことをやって本当に良かったなって思いました So this is my experience So let me remind you my first question What do you want to do? Reason why I'm asking you this question is because I want you guys to expand your interest. You guys just started your university life, that means you have a plenty of time, whatever you want to do. But if you wouldn't do anything, the time will be gone. It just waits, right? So please do whatever you want to do and expand your interest. 皆さんまだこれから大学生活始まったばかりなのでもう自由な時間本当にあるんですよだけどもう何にもやらなかったらもうただ単に終わりな感じなのでじゃなくてもうどんどんとことん自分のやりたいことをやって興味をどんどん広げていってほしいと思います This is my message Thank you so much That's really nice and useful message Thank you So it's your turn Okay, next is my part Before studying my book, I want to say just one thing. That is, this one. I couldn't speak English very much when I was freshman. Really? Yeah. No, I don't believe you. You're my partner, you have to trust me. No, because you can speak English so fluent now. But no, no, I wasn't. No, do you have any proof? Okay. I have the video when I was freshman. Mm -hmm. You mean three years ago? 僕の3年前の英語を話している動画があるのでちょっと聞いてみてください。十二十分終わります。
400 people live there. Wow, it's huge. <laughs> then I said how to everyone. It's like American size, right? American size. <laughs> then as a result, I got many chances to speak English and many friends. Then moreover, I got this prize. Wow, you've got prize. Yeah, what kind of prize is it? That's good. This prize is for the student who had the best behavior. Wow, so you were yes. best student <laughs> out of 400 people? Yeah, out of 400 people. Even you were Japanese? Yeah. I was the only Japanese who got this prize in America. Wow, ever. it's amazing, isn't it? Yeah, wow. <laughs> but what I did is just, I said hello to everyone. Just say hi. Then I got many chances. You can do it right now or tomorrow, right? Mm. Easy. Okay. Next is... Raise your hand. Raise your hand is also easy and good way to get a chance to speak English mm -hmm. in classes. When can I raise my hand? When? Hmm. When you have questions. Oh, got it. Hmm. But what if I don't have any questions? Any questions? Okay, nice. Do you guys have a, Do you guys have any experiences that you don't understand what professors are saying? Yes, I do. I don't understand. You do? Hmm. In the moment, you can raise your hand and say this phrase. Could you say that again? Could you say that again? だから手をクラスでクラスの中で手を挙げるのは質問があるときとか自分の意見を言うときだけではなくだけじゃなくて例えば先生たちが何て言ってるかわかんなくてもう一回言ってほしいっていうときにも手を挙げれるってことですよね